Hi, welcome to Precision Turbo Talks. My name is Grant Gorham, and today we're going to be talking about compressor covers. The first compressor cover we're going to discuss is the B compressor cover. The B compressor cover is a 2.8 inch inlet and a 2.0 inch outlet. The next compressor cover we're going to discuss is the E compressor cover. There's a 3 inch inlet and a 2 inch outlet. The next compressor cover we have is a ported S compressor cover. There's a 4 inch inlet and a 2.5 and inch outlet. The next size compressor cover we have to offer is a ported H compressor cover. There's a 4 inch inlet and a 3 inch outlet. The next size compressor cover we have to offer after the H compressor cover is a sportsman compressor cover. It's a 5 inch inlet and a 4.2 inch outlet. The next size compressor cover we have to offer is our ProMod series compressor cover. The ProMod series compressor cover is a 5 inch inlet and a 4.2 inch outlet. And the largest and final compressor cover we have to offer is our large frame compressor cover, which is a 7 inch inlet and a 4 inch outlet. The B and E compressor cover are the primary choices we have for our entry level turbochargers. These turbochargers can range on our product line from 300 to 900 horsepower. However, with the higher horsepower rated turbochargers, we do recommend a ported compressor cover. The next compressor covers we're going to discuss is our ported S compressor cover and our ported H compressor cover. These compressor covers are typically used on turbochargers ranging from 500 horsepower to 1100 horsepower. The next compressor covers we're going to discuss is our Sportsman compressor cover and our ProMod compressor cover. These compressor covers are typically used on turbochargers that range from 1500 to 2000 horsepower. And finally, we are going to discuss our large frame compressor cover, the biggest compressor cover that we have to offer, which is typically used on turbochargers that produce over 2000 horsepower and up to 3000 horsepower at this time. One of the biggest questions we get asked is, should I run a ported compressor cover or a non-ported compressor cover? As you can see, I'm holding a non-ported compressor cover right now. If you look inside this inlet, there is no map width enhancement or groove. And then if you look inside a standard ported compressor cover, a bullet style or a slot style, you'll see that there's actually a groove that goes all the way around the inlet. This is called the map width enhancement. How the map width enhancement works is when the compressor wheel starts going into compressor wheel stall, choke, or surge, it takes that air and pushes it through the actual groove and then back out the slot, or in this case, the bullet hole, and recirculates it back into the turbocharger, allowing the turbocharger to keep its shaft speed and continue to make boost pressure. If you look at our bigger compressor cover offering, our Sportsman and ProMod compressor cover, you will see that these compressor covers are also offered with the 4.2 inch V-band discharge. The V-band discharge is offered on these covers so that it allows you to lock your piping better and so you can't blow it apart under high boost situations or high flow situations. As you can see, Precision Turbo offers every compressor cover needed to fit your application just perfectly. If you ever do need reference, however, we do offer dimensional drawing and detailed spec information of the compressor covers on page 35 of our catalog. This has been Precision Turbo Talks. Thank you for watching.